Hi, this is Joe from the Velvet Review, professional fly fishing guide and fly box connoisseur. What I have here today is a tacky fly box. This is the original size and the guys who designed this came out with some really innovative concepts. Uh, number one, it has magnetic closure. So no more do you have to get frustrated in figuring out whether your fly box is actually a flash or clip shut or not, which inevitably if it's not clip shut, it spills out and all the flies go everywhere. Uh, all the loose ones that is. So it has magnetic closure, which is really cool. Um, stays shut, easy to open, no mechanical parts to get messed up. Uh, I like the clear and transparent lid. Uh, I use this box on several uh, guided trips where I was in and out of my nymph box quite a bit. And I really did appreciate being able to pop it open, pop it shut, and know that it was sealed. Uh, the other thing that's innovative, and that hence the name Tacky, uh, is this foam. It appears, it's so uh, springy, it appears to be self-healing, although I was told it's not. Uh, the way it works is it's, it's micro-slit, so there's a teardrop shape there, and we'll hopefully, maybe we'll throw a close-up photo of uh, the interior of this box in the review as well. But there's a teardrop and a small slit there. You just take your nymph plug it right into there, it holds it through compression and the nymph stays put. Uh, one thing uh, about micro-slit foam boxes, uh, 10, 15 years ago these were kind of new rage and it was hard to find. There was one company who built them and they were quite expensive. Uh, the nice thing about these is they've become a lot more affordable and there's, there's no shortage of choices, but what ends up happening with most of them is you do this a few times and I lost one loose one there but the thing about that micro slip foam is the flies generally don't come out. Uh, the foam is only as good as how well it's going to hold flies. For me, that passes the test. It grips it very, very effectively. Now, this box called the original. It's seven inches wide by three inches or three and a quarter inches uh, this way. Uh, very handy. They make a couple of different options. Uh, they have one that I'm intrigued by called uh, their Big Bug Box. And what that is, it's a little bit taller profile, so I can put my big hoppers, Chernobyl ants, and screamer patterns, and whatnot in there. And then the foam configuration is different for holding larger flies. Uh, I find this one to be perfect for small nymphs, holds 168 flies. Uh, excellent product, very, very happy with it. I think it's very practical. Uh, the price is right, and uh, you can afford to get a handful of these, and in any kind of bag, the slim profile makes good use of space. You can slide that in there, and you can also see what you're grabbing too, because the front's clear. Tacky Fly Boxes by the Velvet Review.